Good evening, teacher. Welcome. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Good evening. Hi, What's teacher. going on? Hello, Good Carla. Evening. Good evening. How are you? Hello. Ooh, I am fine. Nice. Ah, very good. Hello, Angela. Oh, How are good. you? Hello. Good, good, teacher. Oh, Aquí, nice. Um, on time? On time. All right. Very on good. Time. Yeah. Exactly. You are on time. For, for today. Uh, <laughs> for today's class. For, for today's class. Good evening, Jackie. 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 Sorry. Good evening, Miguel. Sorry, Angela. <laughs> Continue. Ya que, había, ya que había estado viniendo tarde. Now you are early. Responsible as always. Como siempre, as always. Yes. Uh, give me a moment, please. Okay. <clears throat> Good evening, jóvenes. Good evening. Darwin. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, I'm Michelle. sorry. Ah, Michelle is here too, Darwin. Welcome. Thanks. Good evening. All right, good evening. Hi, Michelle. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Adriana. Hello, good evening. Good evening. How do you feel today? Tired. Oh, I imagine. It's bas basically yes. is half of the week, right? We are on half of the week. So it's, I mean, you start to feel tired by this time. Yes. Yeah, okay. But don't worry, you, you will have a lot of participation in the class, okay? So I will, uh, <laughs> okay. Whenever, whenever I ask uh, for participation, so I will say, Michelle, please, Michelle, please, Michelle, please, all right? So you don't fall asleep, all right? Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Very good. Hi, Oscar. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. Oh, nice. It's good to see you. Thank you. We have Ophelia Jansi connected to, right? We have Asalia. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you, Jansi? Good evening. Good evening, Asalia. How are you? Oh, oh nice. Good, Very good. Teacher. Very good, Asalia. Good afternoon, Asalia. Good night, teacher. Ah, good night. <laughs> All right. Very good. So uh, then let's, uh, well, let's wait like one more minute and then we, uh, we start uh, with the uh, with the attendance and then we continue with the class, okay? So I hope everyone is, is ready for today. By the way, is it raining in your place? Yes, Michelle? Yes, well, yes. yes it sure. it's raining here. It's raining, mm. it's raining yes. in San Salvador. Yes. What time, yes. what time uh, did the rain start? What time did the rain start? Uh, uh, six thirty o'clock. Six. Uh, okay. Basically, eight, in the in the evening. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock at night. Okay. Seven here. In San Juan Pico. Yeah. Uh, oh, I imagine. It's like a, about uh, six to eight, right? About six to eight. The rain has started. All right. Very good. So um, here is rain, but it rained in the afternoon. So in this moment, it's not raining. So I hope. I hope not to have connection problems today, okay? That's my expectation, that's my hope. All right, so let's start uh, then with the attendance. So let me start here, Ada, Adriana. Present. Michelle. Present, present. Angela. Present teacher. Asalia. Present teacher. Darwin. Present teacher. Very good. Flor. Flor no se nos conectó ayer y no la veo ahora tampoco. Gloria. Carla. Present teacher. Very good. Margarita. 
Mayra. Present. Miguel. Present teacher. Nelson. Nelson. Present. He's, he's, he's saying present. present. I hear. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, Ophelia. Ophelia. No, not yet. Osmin. Present teacher. Good evening. Ra Good evening. Rafa. Ya llegó Flor. Ah, oh yeah, I see Flor. Ya vamos a regañar a Flor ahorita. Good evening. Good evening. I'm Good kidding. Evening. I'm kidding, Flor. Okay, Rafa. Present. All right. Please don't talk about La Selecta today, all right? Don't talk about La Selecta today, please. Please okay? don't talk about this. No, don't, let's not talk about La Selecta, please. Rosa? Rosa? Not connected. Sandra? Jansi? Present. Zulma? Present. Edwin? Ingrid? Lourdes? Oscar? Present. And Susana? All right, very good. Uh, so everybody, uh, so welcome uh, to today's class. Uh, I could see that uh, many of you, okay, many of you had problems uh, completing the exercise about the present continuous, okay? But the good news is that today we will study the present continuous, okay? So in case you want to make some changes, you can make changes today or tomorrow, okay? Remember, sorry, Remember that we have a uh, tomorrow to finish the week, okay? Tenemos mañana todavía para terminar la semana. Antes de la sesión, before the session, okay? Porque después de la sesión yo me quedo pasando la, a la, las notas. I pass the grades, okay? So uh, today we will study the present continuous. And there is an exercise about the present continuous. And some people were texting me that they had problems in this exercise, okay? If you completed the platform, Perfect. Si ya completaron el trabajo de la semana, perfecto, perfect. If you haven't finished, si no han terminado, uh, try to finish tomorrow, before the class, okay? Intenten terminar mañana antes de la sesión, before the session, okay? So uh, let's start uh, with uh, today's topic. But before I start, I want to ask you, um, what did you study yesterday? What did you study yesterday? Do you remember? Any idea? Any idea? What did you study yesterday? Yep. Any idea? Yeah. Procedure to second training mode. Ah, exactly, exactly. We studied uh, procedures, okay, uh, or vocabulary for procedures, uh, like for a training, okay? Like when you want to take a training, okay? Uh, you, need, you need some vocabulary, okay? Uh, to write to human resources or to your boss or to your manager, I don't know, all right? So we studied some vocabulary for procedures. What vocabulary do you remember? What vocabulary do we use for procedures? For example, we studied about a procedure um, about RC company. What vocabulary do you remember in the procedure we studied? ¿Qué vocabulario recuerdan del procedimiento que estudiamos? Do you remember any vocabulary? Maybe the truth. Sorry? Recruit, recruitment. Recruitment. Okay, well, yeah, but yeah. that's vocabulary. But uh, ah, when, okay. you, when you want to... Uh, to request a training to human resources, you need to complete some information, right? Yeah? So what vocabulary do you use? I mean, to, to, to request a training. ¿Qué vocabulario usan para solicitar una capacitación? What vocabulary do you use? Any idea? Take place. Sorry? Take place. All right, you need to write the place of the training. What else? The place, yeah, the place, what else? 
if you work part time or full time? Yeah, that's important too. What else is important for a training uh, to request a training? Hey. Sorry. Authorization. Okay, the authorization. Okay, uh, or the information. Uh, important to authorize the training. Yeah. Okay. What else? What about the the, the name duties. of the duties? Yeah, the duties. the duties. Yeah, that's okay. What else? Sorry. Schedule. Ah, the schedule, schedule. That's right. Yeah, the schedule. That, that's right. The date. The date is important. What else is important? Order. The, the training. Date and time. The, the name. name of the name of the training. Yes, the name of the training. The hours, mm -hmm. for example. Okay, and the hours. What are, hours. The hours. Okay, of the training. What about the price? Is the price important? Yes. 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 Yes, right. Yes. If it's if it's not free, the price is very important. Okay, so basically this is the vocabulary. Uh, place, place. Exactly the place. So this is the vocabulary we started yesterday. Okay. So on uh, when when you um when you uh, ask okay or request a training, you need to follow like this procedure. For example, okay, uh, you need to choose first to select the training uh, you are interested in all right uh, you need to check with the talent management consultant okay if you are like okay to take the training you need to, to send a note okay uh, to request your participation to write the name of the training that's important the name of the training the date of the training and the hours of instruction the place all right that's important too the price okay how much uh, the training is and then you send it to human resources. Very good. Now that's in general. But now check this information Ishe. here. Yeah? Ishe. Yeah, tell me. Ishe. Yeah. Uh, when when you use tapes or kinds? Uh, when to use? When cuando debemos usar kind or types? Time or types? Uh huh. A time you are you are you are uh, saying time about hora. How many? No no times? no no. Time, tipo. A type. Time. Okay. Type and. In type. In type. Mm -hmm. In plural and in singular. Let me see uh, if I get the equation. Type is in singular, and types is in plural. No. No, I don't get your kind. question. <laughs> kind. Kind. A uh -huh. kind. kind, okay. When to use kind, kind and when to use kind, kind, uh -huh. right? It's the same, basically. Yeah. Like, what kind of courses? What type of courses? Is the same. Is the same purpose. There's no difference. Uh, yeah, kind is uh, type. They're synonyms, okay? Ah, uh, okay, perfect. All right, very good. So let's continue then. So listen, uh, on this part, okay, on page number thirty-four, you have some trainings, okay? Do you have some trainings or events that is the same? Uh, the first one is excellent customer service. The second is improving your computer skills or abilities, organizing time, effective communication, creating websites, and learning about writing skills. And we have the dates, the possible dates for these trainings, okay? July 7th, July 10th and 11th, July 15th, uh, July 17th, the other, July 19th, and July 28th. We have the, the number of hours of instruction, like four hours, 10 hours, blah, blah, blah. Then the place, right? Hotel center, our facilities, hotel center, hotel, blah, blah, blah. And then the price, okay? That's important. If it's free, no problem. Some courses are free or some trainings are free, but other trainings, uh, have a cost okay other trainings have a cost now listen based on this based on this information okay based on this information i want you to think okay listen carefully pay attention here i want you to think of a training you want to take okay think of a training you want to take 
I don't know what the training is. It depends on your area, okay? It depends on your area. And please write a training or write a note, okay? Write a note about the training. In the note, include the name of the, name of the training, the date, the hours of instruction, the place, and the price. For example, for example, okay? Imagine um, I start and I say, um, I want to take a course in the note, on the training note, uh, or I am interested. I am interested in the linguistics course, for example, linguistics uh, course or linguistic skills. Uh, the, the, the event is going to take place on September 14th, for example. Uh, the hours of instructions are uh, eight hours in one day. And at uh, the place uh, it will happen is um, Crown Plaza Hotel, for example. And the price is, or the training is $100, okay? So the idea is that you write a note about a training you want to take, okay? And you specify the event, the date, the hours of instruction, the place and the price, okay? Si no saben una ahorita, use your imagination, usen su imaginación, okay? Y escriban una pequeña notita. The note is for human resources, right? Because, or the, for the talent management consultant, I don't know, okay? Any question? Yes, teacher, este, this event is really, really in my workplace, in my, yes? The idea is to write a note about your area, about your okay. area of okay. work, okay? okay? In your case, it's technology, right? It can be a training related to technology, okay? That you want to take, okay? okay? Yes, the idea is to make okay. a training request. La idea es hacer una solicitud de una capacitación, okay? That's the idea, yeah? Okay, any other question? Any other question? No question, teacher. All right, very good. Let's start. Let's get started. Specify the event, uh, the hours of instructions, and all the information, okay? Required. Here is the information, okay? So include the event, the name of the event, the date, the hours of instruction, the place, and the price. This is on page number 34. Okay, this is on page number 34. All right, let's start to work. What happened yesterday, Floor? Floor? Hello. Hello, what happened yesterday? We didn't see you in class. Eh, se me complicó. Ah, okay. Tuve una reunión ahí y no me pude conectar. I understand, it's okay. Teacher, solo vamos a llenar un cuadrito así como este. Yes, only one. Uh, you don't have to do I mean, listen, the idea is to write it in general. Let me, let me, let me go here. I said the sentences, right? Okay. And the example is, let me share the document with you. Okay. You will say, for example, the idea is that you, uh, that you write uh, the note. Hold on a second. The idea is that you write the note on this page. If you have the photocopy. Okay. 
it says training note on page uh, number uh, 34, okay? So listen, for example, you can say, um, I don't know. I don't know who you are going to direct the note, the note to. No sé a quién van a dirigir la nota. And be to the human resources coordinator, the generalist, or I don't know, the talent management consultant. I don't know, right? So for example, you can say, if you that that's if you want that's if you want eso es si quieren no es necesario it's not necessary but the information is necessary for example you can say um i am interested you can say right it's like a paragraph como un pequeñito paragraph i am interested in taking um the improving computer skills training for example okay number two okay uh the training is going to happen on September 14th, okay? Uh, the hours of instructions are eight hours. And the place uh, or the training uh, will take place in, in my workplace, for example, I don't know, or in hotel or Crown Plaza Hotel. And the price in is $100 in English. Yes, in English. No, no. Plata en línea. Yes, uh, it's like a... Plataforma Zoom. <laughs> Sorry? Ah, it can be online. Oh. I didn't get you. Ah, it be can online? be online. Mm -hmm. It can be online okay. or, or present, okay? That's your decision. If you want to this uh, to 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 make it online or you are going to be present, I mean it's optional, okay? No hay problema por la cámara, Salia. Si no funciona, there's no problem. The most important is to be connected. Okay, teacher. Thank All you. right. It's, yeah, I can see your camera doesn't work. It's okay, don't worry. But I know you are here. Okay. La introducción es opcional. Pueden, pueden escribir si quieren ahí, Dear Human Resources, or Dear Human Resources Generalist, or Dear what? Talent Management Consultant, okay? I am interested in taking the improving skills training, okay? Teacher. Uh, yeah? What did you say about uh, the introduction? No, no, I mean that you can say dear, dear, a mm. talent management consultant, for example, dear is like querido, it's like respectful, it's yes, something yes, respectful. Yes. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right. O si saben el nombre de la persona que está a cargo, pueden poner el nombre directamente, right? You can put the name exactly like if you know the name of the person in charge of trainings in human resources, write the name, okay? Escriban el nombre de una vez. Imagínense, imagínense que es Carla. You, say, you write, dear Carla Vasquez, for example.
how much time do you need? Do you need more time? Yes, how much? How much time? Three minutes, four minutes, three minutes. Okay, I will give you three minutes, all right? Three more minutes, three more minutes. Okay, very good. Okay, listen, uh, if you have, if you don't have all the information uh, needed for a note, uh, for a training note, sorry, it's okay, don't worry, okay? Just share the information you have. Now pay attention here, pay attention. We are going to go to breakout rooms in groups, of course, okay? In the groups, in the groups, you read the note to your classmates, okay? and your classmates are going to guess your position at the company. And your classmates are going to guess the position in your company. For example, imagine I say, um, my note, right? Imagine in this moment, you are the group. You are the group, okay? You are my group. And I am going to read the note, the training note for you. And I say, uh, dear talent management consultant, I am interested in taking um, a course for uh, technology in the classroom, a course for technology in the classroom. And uh, the training is going to take place in October, okay? Uh, the, number, the number of hours is 20, 20 hours. 
and the price is two hundred dollars. What is my position or what is my work? What is my position, right? Well, what is my occupation or my, my profession? What is my profession or my job? Uh, uh, I think about technology. I, I said technology in the classroom. Technology in the classroom, I say. I so said. A professor, it's a teacher. That's a right. Teacher. A teacher, exactly. So my profession is a teacher or can be occupation, right? Too, okay. But for, for some people, maybe. Okay, I repeat the idea is that you share the, the note to your group and your group is going to guess your profession or occupation, okay? Ellos van a adivinar su profesión o su ocupación. But don't tell them, all right? No le digan, don't tell them. If they want to know, they will ask you questions. Si ellos quieren saber, le van a hacer preguntas, okay? Like, for example, are you a doctor? No. And you say, no, I am not. Oh, then are you a mason or a, a, an architect, all right? Or are you a manager in the company? Are you a supervisor, all right? Yes? Yeah? You got it? Clear? Clear. All right, let's go to working groups then, all right? No le digan que adivinen ellos, okay? Let them guess, please. Let them guess. All right, let's go to working groups then. Ofelia va a participar en la actividad. Hola, Ofelia. Oh, she went. Adriana, hello. Where? Yes. Okay, Maya. Uh, you want to start, Angela? Um, <clears throat> you, um, uh, next. <laughs> Alguien más? Me. Me perdió el apunte cuando dije. <laughs> <Me. laughs> okay, I teacher. Oh, oh, oh. Solo tengo duda. Yo tengo que describir lo que de, del training que yo eh, estoy interesado, pero no tengo que decir el nombre, ¿verdad? No. Me lo tienen, no, me lo tienen que, que, que I mean, adivinar. You, you don't have to say your profession or your position in the company. And the idea ah, okay. is that according to the information you give uh, to Zulma and Angela, Zulma and Angela will try to guess your profession or your position at the company, okay? Okay. Pero, but, me, pero, pero tenemos que decir cuál es nuestra posición en la empresa no, o no? No, no. Ah, no, no. ah, pues ya lo tengo. They guess for you. Ellos adivinan, okay? Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, eh, 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 for example, for me, I start. Um, eh, eh, in, in, the, in the company, I... I start a responsibility in the platform only video the, the cable television. Um, I, I have the responsibility uh, connection, it checks only server in the, in the processing, the only stream, the video, the audio thing. The, platform different platform the the channel uh, television is is in my is my work is miss miss task it is checks only today uh, check uh, 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 some time some someone 
eh, tickets or, or false uh, in, the, in different platform. This is my, my, my position. No, I don't know. Is um, that? Uh, what training do you interest? Ma, for me, I is interested in trying an international workshop programming with basic Python intermediate. Okay, you are um development. Uh, developer. Yes. Developer. 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 Dev yes. Yes. Well, a programmer or a programmer. Are you a programmer? Program. Yeah. Ah, okay. There you it's go. Correct. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh. <laughs> the earth just really yeah. let in imagine the name. Yes. <laughs> uh, I am interested in the event you made the the training is new producer of the use the raw material. The date start is October 9 to 12. The duration or is 24 hours. The ubication play is Hotel Royal de Cameron in Salinita. The cost of price is free. Free. Oh, the camera free. Yo quiero. Yeah. <laughs> I want to go. <laughs> yes. <laughs> My company pay. Oh. Good. Okay. Um, Asalia, you. Asalia. Oh, what is, what is his profession? Did you guess? Ya adivinaron cuál es la profesión. The idea is that you guess Darwin's profession oh, or occupation, okay. okay? Did you guess? Ya adivinaron. Did you guess? No, okay, guess. Try to guess. Intenten adivinar. <laughs> mm. I forget. As you supervisor? <laughs> uh, no, I am not supervisor. Mm. Y esto que me ha dicho manager. <laughs> no, I am not manager. No, presupuestos. Y... Hay que, oh, sorry, <laughs> question, eh, hay que hay... poner las, las que están acá, las posiciones, o, o en sí, eh, la, lo real. No, the idea, Salia, is that you guess Darwin's position in the company. According to the information he gave you, de acuerdo a la información que le dio, what is his position at the company? Or what is his profession? Oh. Basados en Mi la información, idea. okay? What is the profession? Eh, entonces, repita, iba a ir a... repeat, please. <laughs> Yo solo me acuerdo que iba a ir a de <laughs> Se fue Remember. de viaje de Cameron, se Era fue de la ciudad. Are you pro, human resource? <laughs> so, I mentioned Training. my position in the company. Is manager. Is not. Jefe de producción, de production. Manager no. de production. No. Inventor. Technicians. <laughs> Inventory? No. Give them the information again. Ah, uh, uh, seminary raw materia? Inventory? <laughs> exec executive? Because executive. the raw material. Executive. Ah, raw material, okay. <laughs> Char, char, charge, charge, the raw material. 
not exclusive the analyst cost. Analyst. Uh, oh, analyst. Analyst presupuesto. Budget. Oh, budget. <laughs> budget is presupuesto. Budget. Ah, analyst. Yes. Yes. Analyst of the cost. A cost okay. analyst. It's a cost analyst. Ah, cost analyst. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hi, we finished Hello. the exercise. And did you and did you uh, guess the position of your classmate? Yes, Jancy is a constant. An accountant and you yeah, and yes, Jancy, yes. what is Susana's and position? Susan is, Susan is administrative. Uh, she's analyst administrative. Okay, very good. An administrative analyst. 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 Administrative <laughs> analyst. All right, very good. Analyst. Conversando, coincidimos en que no podemos resolver una oración de una tarea. Which one? <laughs> ¿Cuál oración? Which sentence? I think it's the same that is given. Está en la tarea 16, el plan número 2. De hecho, le iba a enviar ahora la, la imagen y se me había escapado. Okay, la vamos a revisar Pero, ahora. La vamos a revisar juntos. Ok. Ok. Ya la, me, me recuerdan cuando vaya. Eh, bueno, al final, me, eh, unos 10 minutos antes me recuerdan para que la revisemos juntos. Ok. 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 okay. All right. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay, I show you my now dancing. Analyst. Mm -hmm. eh, le, le, le voy le voy a, 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 a leer lo que escribí. Okay. Y me corrí. Okay. No, I don't have name of the company. Two okay. human resource only. Okay. Two human resource present. I am interested in the signing uh, effective communication. In, in day uh, 18 July, 19 July, the time of instruction, the house, the house, Uh, the place is in hotel center and the price is free also and and the name of employees is i puse algunos nombres what is his position okay. rosa okay you need an effective communication training Maybe you are um, the last time you say that you, you, you <laughs> teach. You teach. I think that you you are teaching. You to teach. You teach in the school with kids. I remember. Maybe a teacher. Yeah, exactly. I am teacher. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You you have to you have to communicate. Uh, very well. <laughs> okay. Uh, my my, pro, my proposal is. Uh, purpose. Uh, is your purpose? Purpose. Uh, purpose. My purpose. Yeah, exactly. My purpose is uh, uh, teaching very good. And explain you. Explain you when you are talking. Uh, that the other fun. people. Uh, uh, I don't know, maybe pay attention. More, more mm -hmm. effective in communication. Mm -hmm. you, you have to effective communication. Okay. okay. In Ophelia, I arrived late and I, I didn't listen to Ophelia. Uh, I am. Um, Elaboration means uh, information, uh, elaboration, the report is um, 
Ay, entré, ¿cómo se dice? Entré a una sala de reuniones. I enter. I, I can't. I enter. I, I enter the, the meeting room. The meeting room. Oh. A breakout room. Breakout room. Breakout room. My first. Mi primera vez. My first time. My first time. Eh, I very. Me gustó mucho. I like. I like. I like. I like. I liked it. I liked it. Mm, so. The bad. The, the bad. Eh, the time. The interview. Mm, mm, more hot, mucho calor, cuando salí ¿verdad? del trabajo, de, de la empresa. Pero, but, eh, the interview, I like, I like, I like, o sea, the person, the, the site, el lugar, very pretty, bonito, muy bonito. Uh -huh. eh, mm, me entrevistaron, ¿cómo se dice? Me, ma, I... I had an interview. I had an interview. I have a neither. Interview. Interview. I have a interview. Um, five, five person. Okay, everyone. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, now, qu quick question, okay? Uh, did you guess uh, your classmates' uh, profession or position in the company? Did you guess? Adivinaron? Did you guess? Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. All right. That's excellent. That's very good. Uh, okay. Very good. Now, I have a question, like in general, for everybody, okay? Uh, the question is, when, okay, when you... When you take a training, when you take a training, uh, do you have uh, to write uh, a note? Do you have to write a note when you take a training? Yes or no? Yes, I do. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Everybody, everybody. Another question. Uh, do you have a form or a format when you, uh, or to, 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 to apply for a training, do you have a format or form? Yes. Yes, yes. Yes, and the others, do you have something like a template, una plantilla, do you have like a template when you want to apply for a training? No. For me. Only an email. Only an email, you only write an email, very describe good. Describing describe the, the... Okay, the training. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, very good. Now, the, the next question is, um, what parts or what information do you include in the email, Rosa, in this case? For example, uh, the name of the training, the hour, the place, the day, the cost, and, and something explaining the reason that to it's take necessary. The uh -huh. okay. It's necessary in the training. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Thank you very much. Uh, what about you, Miguel? Yes, it's have... the, the same the same information. Okay. Uh, in my case, uh, I sent to uh, uh, Tim's uh, relatives to my to my to my job. Okay. Uh, and yeah, and with this information, with this with this all information, says Rosa. Uh, depend of the the uh, me dijeron presupuesto pero no me acuerdo cómo budget es. budget budget depend of the budget uh, to approve or not okay that that's important it depends on yes. the price it depends on the price and the budget yes. of the company yes. right uh, to approve the yes. training to approve yes. the training I I have um three three 3,000 more or less 
on in all the year. Okay. For the different training, training for, for different this is only for, for different training. Different training or this is only a training. The cost is uh, uh, elevate uh, or this or this cost is expensive. Hi. Mm -hmm. Only one. It's only one training. Okay. Very yes. good. I, I like it. Uh, what yeah. about you, Flor? Uh, do you have money? Like, does the company give you money to take trainings, Flor? Does the company give you money to take the trainings? Hello, Flor. Hello, teacher. Um, in my case, uh, depend the price. It depends on the price. All right. Yes. So price is important. Okay. And, and when you, uh, how do you do it? Do you send an email or do you write a note? When you want to take a training, cuando quieres tomar un, una capacitación, do you send an email or you write a note? I, I don't know. <laughs> I. Or you don't do anything. Okay. Or no, no hace nada. Solo te dan la capacitación. They only give you the training. Um, I, I make the solicit, solicitude. Ah, the request. The request. I make the request. Ah, I see. Uh, human good. resources. To human resources. Excellent. Very good. That's excellent. Uh, now let's see, let's listen to Ala's opinion. Um, Ada, Ada, uh, do you, uh, I mean, when you want to take a training, uh, do you send an email or you write a note or how do you do it? Como lo hacen? How do you do it? The microphone. For, for, for me, email, teacher. Yeah. Ah, you send an email. Okay, very good. Yeah. And do you have money like, does the company give you money to take trainings? Do they give you money or? Yes, yes. they give you money, all right? I, I, I ask this question because some people, they have to pay for the training, okay? Some mm -hmm. employees need to pay for the training. Uh, the company doesn't give money for trainings, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, what about you, Adriana? Does the company give you money for the trainings? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. That's really good. Okay, everyone, thank you very much for taking the time to practice, okay, and to share your note, okay. Uh, thank you very much, okay. So uh, can, can you please go to reactions and give thumbs up for the participations? Demosle thumbs ups a los que participaron. So go to reactions and let's give thumbs up. Okay, thank you for your participations, for the ones who participated. And let's go to the next activity. Okay, listen. And in the next activity, I have some questions on a slide, on a PowerPoint slide, okay? And the questions are the following. The questions are, what are some qualities a good employee needs to have? Or some qualifications a good employee needs to have? You can say, for example, uh, leadership, solidarity, or proactivity, or what? I don't know, okay? Or management okay or communication skills i don't know all right so what are some qualities a good employee needs to have so make a list you can write like four skills or four abilities question number two what is the most essential quality to get a promotion when you want to get promoted in your company okay like to get a better position in your company what is the most important quality Maybe you can tell me, oh, teacher, I consider uh, teamwork, equi eh, trabajo en equipo, or I consider leadership, for example, liderazgo, I don't know, all right? So please take a moment and answer the two questions. So for question number one, you can write like three or four qualities, okay? And for question number two, it's only one, okay? the most essential or the most important quality to get a promotion. Mientras tanto, les paso asistencia. In the meantime, I pass the attendance, okay? Ada, 
Present. Adriana. Present. Michelle. Present. Angela. Present, teacher. Very good. Azalia. Present. Darwin. Present, teacher. Flor. Present. Gloria. Here. Carla. Here, teacher. Margarita. Margarita. Mayra. Present. Miguel. Present, teacher. Nelson. Present, teacher. Ofelia. Here, teacher. Osmin. Present teacher. Rafa. Present. Rosa. Present. Sandra. Present teacher. Jansi. Present teacher. Zulma. Present. Ingrid. Lourdes. Lourdes, Oscar, Oscar, en Susana, present. All right, thank you. I repeat, in question number one, just make a list of three or four qualities, okay? And in number two, it's only one quality. The, the uh, inequality. Sorry? Uh, in, the, in the first question. The in the first question. Good. Any any quality? Yes, the, the, the qualities okay. you consider, okay. The qualities you consider a new, a good employee needs, okay. okay. We are talking about uh, a good employee, right? So it's personal, okay. Example example, punctual in your arrival. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you can say punctuality directly. Punctuality. Oh yeah, punctuality. Okay. Yeah, because the, the 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 quality is punctuality. Okay, that's the quality. Oh, yeah. Okay, yes. Okay. You can include values here. Pueden incluir algunos valores. You can include some values. Okay. Respect. Respect. You better say respect. Okay. The quality is respect. Respect. respect, respect. Okay, respect. Are you ready? So uh, if you want, make a screenshot of the questions, okay? Pueden hacer una captura de, la, de las preguntas. Make a screenshot of the questions. Okay, uh, the questions are also on page number 35, okay? Las preguntas también están en la página 40, 35, sorry. The questions are on page number 35. 
35. Okay, activity one. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready? Please let me know. Are you ready? Yes, no, no, not yet. Yes, no. Yes. No, okay. no, Some no. people say no. Okay, okay. One, one more minute, okay? One more minute. No, no deben escribir un gran texto, okay? Solo la, directamente la, la cualidad. Liderazgo, respeto, only that, okay? Only that. You don't have to write like a, a big text. No, okay, it's not necessary. For example, punctuality, respect, leadership, solidarity, proactivity, uh, discipline, I don't know, okay? Organization. I'm giving you ideas, okay? Take notes. Dios bendiga, que va bien. Bendiga, amén. Ok. Now, are you ready? Don't say no, please. I gave you some ideas, all right? I gave you some ideas. All right. Now, uh, let's start uh, with the question, okay? Uh, for this question, we are not going to go to, uh, to break our rooms, okay? We will discuss the question here. Okay, in the main session, okay? So um, I will ask, uh, I will select somebody to ask the questions and then this person or this participant will select another participant and will ask the questions. And the other participant will select another participant and will ask the questions, okay? So I start, okay, let's see. Uh, let's listen to Jancy. Okay, Jancy, uh, for you, what are some qualities a good employee needs to have? Is for Okay. Uh, abilities, the communication, and work in teams. Work in teams. And, and other values, for example, respect and leadership. And? Uh, respect and, you said? Respect and? Um, leadership. And leadership. Okay, very good. Okay, thank you very much. Second question, Jancy. Okay. Uh, what is the most essential quality to get a promotion? Do the job well. Ah, do the job. Okay, to do the job very well. All right, very good. Okay, excellent. To do the job very well. Okay, that's excellent. Very good. Thank you very much, Jancy. Uh, now, Jancy, can you please uh, select somebody to ask the questions? Um... Michelle. Okay, ask Michelle. Michelle. Okay. Yes. Michelle, what are some qualities that good employees need to have? Well, I think that some qualities 
are uh, working teams, uh, work under pressure, have a good good communication, uh, be honest, and uh, proactivity. Okay, second question. Uh, what is the most essential quality to get a promotion? Proactivity. Okay, thank you very much. Very good. Work under pressure. I really like that. <laughs> All right, very good. I really like that and I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you very much. Okay, Anna Michelle, can you select somebody please to, to ask the questions? Mm, maybe Darwin? All right. Okay, Darwin. What are some qualities and good a good employee needs to have? In my case, I think the qualities first responsibility, second respect, third punctuality. Okay. And what is the most essential quality to get a promotion? Uh, be frank with the boss. Okay. So, sorry, can, can you repeat the most essential quality, please? I think be frank with the boss. Ah, all right. I, I got it. I got it. So I, that means like to not to have problems with the boss. In other yeah. words, right? In yeah. other words, in other words, is not having problems with your boss, like relax with your boss all right take it easy with your boss yeah yes be fine all right very good thank you darwin thank you michelle uh darwin can you select another participant please okay uh, rosa elena okay ask her okay rosa elena what are some qualities a good employee need to have um, for me, her responsibility, teamwork, passion, uh, punctuality, uh, that Michelle said, uh -huh. uh, work under that? pressure. And, ah, yes, it oh, leadership. I mentioned leadership. Okay, only that. Okay, leadership. And the second question is, what is the most essential quality to get a promotion? For me, are the experience. The experience in, in the, the company. Mm -hmm. I like it. Very good. Thank you, Darwin okay. and Rosa. Okay, Rosa, can you select another participant, please? Ah, yeah. Oh, my God. Ah, yeah. um, someone. Almost to turn off the camera. <laughs> no. Um, <laughs> okay, I ask uh, ah, yeah. Miguel. Sí, All right. Okay, Miguel. Uh, what are some qualities a good employee needs to have? Sí. Uh, the the qualities uh, I think uh, is responsible, efficient, and teamwork. Okay, what is the most essential quality to get a promotion? Be proactive. Okay, very good. That's excellent. Okay, thank you, Rosa and Miguel. Okay, and thank you, everybody, because I know everybody has the answer. All right. Now, I, I ask, like, in general, okay, if we rank, if we rank uh, three abilities to get a promotion, okay, I will mention three. Leadership, proactivity, and teamwork. Leadership, proactivity, and teamwork, okay? So, to get a promotion, what do you think is the most important of the three abilities I mentioned? What is the most Proactive. important to get a promotion? Proactivity. Pro Pro Proactivity. Proactivity. All right. Second. 
The second leadership. most essential? Leadership. 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 And the third most essential? Teamwork. 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 Okay. I mean, the three, the three uh, abilities are important, right? But we can rank them. Okay. So thank you very much, everybody, for uh, participating. Positive, positive attitude. Exactly, to have a positive attitude, to have a positive attitude. That's very important. That's true. Thank you very stay, much. Stay, stay or similar or proactive. It's similar to proactivity, to have a post. Yeah, but proactivity is like to have ideas, I feel, right? Like to have very good ideas and to, and to give them, to share them, all right? And to have a positive attitude is like to, to see like even if something is negative, to see the positive side of it, okay? The yes, positive yes. side of the situation, okay? Um, um, generate solution, no problems. Exactly, and to generate solutions or to give solutions to problems, okay? Not to bring problems, but to give solutions, okay? That's important, Melanie. Thank you very much. Yes. Oh my God, I really like your <laughs> ideas. I can see you are very good uh, workers. Teacher, today, yes, someone, today someone tell me, uh, 100 no uh, a percent is an attitude and percent is no knowledge it's knowledge no. yeah no. very but good no, very. No, 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 no. knowledge is conocimiento knowledge oh. yes I, I like it i really like the quote i like it okay thank you very much okay everybody uh thank you very much and because i know everybody has the answer not everybody participated but everybody has the answer i know Okay, I know. So please, uh, let's go, okay, to reactions and let's give thumbs up for everybody. Let's give thumbs up for everybody, okay, because everybody has the answer. So go to reactions and let's give thumbs up for everybody. Okay, very good. Okay, nice. Okay, well done. Thank you very much. Very good. Now let's go to the next activity. Okay, listen, listen up. Um, in the next activity, Okay, uh, it's on page number 35, okay? On page number 35, we have, um, okay, hold on a second. Okay, yes. On page number uh, 35, we have a conversation, okay? Now listen, listen carefully and pay attention here. I want you to read the conversation. I want you to read the conversation and, and think, about three questions about the conversation. Three questions you can ask. Piensen en tres preguntas que pueden hacer acerca de la conversación. Three questions, but don't write them. No las escriban. Don't write the questions, please. Only think about the questions, okay? For example, for example, good morning, this is Pedro Brigitte. Good morning, Brigitte, this is Max from HR. Question number one can be, uh, where does Mr. Brigitte work? Or in which department does Mr. Rigid work? That's one question, right? For me. But don't, don't, don't answer the questions, okay? The idea is in this moment that you think of three questions. La idea es que ustedes piensen en tres preguntas que les pueden hacer a sus compañeros acerca de la conversación, okay? Think, piensen, don't write, only think. Two minutes for this, two minutes for this. Don't write the questions, Rosa. <laughs> I'm watching you, I'm watching you, okay? Only think about the questions, okay? You don't have to write.
Okay. Okay, that, that's enough time, okay? If you have one or two questions, it's okay, no problem, okay? Now, please, listen to the pronunciation of the conversation carefully. Listen carefully, please. Good morning, this is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? We are checking on some preferences, references. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what it is required at a managerial position? Listen again, please. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. What kind of information do you need? We are checking on some references. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings. And the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what it is required at a managerial position? Okay, so the conversation is on page number 35, okay? The conversation is on page number 35. Now listen to the instruction. You will work in pairs, okay? And you will practice the conversation, but before you practice before you practice the conversation ask questions about the conversation okay before you practice ask questions about the conversation okay so imagine carla is going to practice with susana so carla is going to ask questions to susana about the conversation and susana can ask carla some questions about the conversation okay and obviously carla answers and susana answers when you finish you practice the conversation, okay? Is it clear? Yes. 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 All right. Very good. All right. Very good. So let's go in pairs. The conversation is on page number um thirty-five. Okay. The conversation is on page number thirty-five. Just let me see. Ophelia, are you going to? Yeah, Ophelia is connected. I always get confused with Ophelia. Asalia, are you going to participate in the activity? Yes, teacher, aquí estoy, solo que no, no me deja ver la laptop. Ah. Okay, okay. Lourdes, are you going to participate in the activity? Hi, Lourdes. I think she's not going to participate. So let, let me make pairs then. We are going to work in pairs, okay? So let's go to breakout rooms. We are going to make uh, 10 groups, okay? 10 pairs, sorry. All right, let's go to practice. Hello. Hello. ¿Con quién voy a trabajar, teacher? ¿Aparece por ahí la invitación? No. Ok, let me send you to a group. Okay. Pero ya les, ya les mandé la invitación, Lourdes. Aquí no me aparece, creo que ya está asignada, solo tiene que aceptar. Ah, ok. Ya está asignada al, 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 al 10, al equipo 10. Room 10.
more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? We are checking on some reference. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings and the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see that you consider he has what is, is required at a um, managerial position. Okay. Bueno. Cambiamos ahora. Por favor, sí. Uh, just a reminder, sorry, before you start. Uh, Osmin, remember that today you have the one-on-one -on -one session, okay? Yes, and posting, no. Sorry? Posting, no. All 15, can I It's today. Eh, pero cambié. ¿Con quién cambié? Cambié, sí. Con... Cambié con... Con Margarita. Con, ya le digo. Con, no, cambié con Ángela. No, permítame. Aquí lo noté, dije, perdón. El Facebook okay. Day me toca eh, con Sandra. Ah, con Sandra. Ok. Sandra tendría que estar hoy entonces. Now, uh, and me, 15. Ok, so you are on the 15. No. ¿Qué fecha? Como adelantamos. Sí, sí, sí. sí. Este, pero ca cam cambió con Sandra. Con Sandra le tocaba... Ayer que me tocaba a mí. No, pero excuse me, now, now. Today, now. Ajá, ahora okay. le toca a usted, ajá, ahora le toca a usted, cambió exactly. con Sandra. Exacto, today. Ajá, cambió Sandra. Con Sandra. Vaya, estaría, ahora estaría Sandra entonces. Exacto. Ok, 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 I will tell Os her, I will tell her. Osme, okay. but uh, 15 is holiday. Exactly. Y has suelto el 15. Oh, yeah. No, I don't remember. Sandra <laughs> está el 13, on the 13th. Sería el 13, okay. en su caso. Entonces, el 13. Me. Thank uh -huh. you. Okay, no problem. Aquí, aquí. Oh, okay. Okay, yes. okay, continue, please. Okay. Okay. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max. Dice, eh, eh, él es, he is responsible. No, no, uh, in, the, in the first, yes, but the second, how time? Por ejemplo, Omar le dice... I think he's very responsible, in the number one. I, uh, I think, I think quality is promoting. He's very responsible. Mm -hmm. And the question, Other question? What qualities have Mauricio Sanchez for being promoted? And the answer is he is very responsible. What? He is very responsible. Si no le escucho la pregunta okay. completa, completo. Ok, sería, what qualities have Mauricio Sánchez for be promoted? And the answer is, he is very responsible. Ah, esta es la que yo le hice, la yes. casi la misma, similar. Yes, yes, I, I, la ordené, no sé cómo se dice la ordené. <laughs> ok, ya la, la hice, la pasé. Ok, and the second question is, how time Mauricio Sánchez was supervisor? O, o what, ¿Cuánto él was supervisor? ¿Cuánto tiempo ha trabajado en esa posición en la que está ahorita? How time? How time? How much? How much time? How much, how much, how much time? How much time Mauricio Sánchez? Okay. How much time? Work. Work. Yes. How much time is working, teacher? How much time was Mauricio Sanchez a supervisor? Ah, 
was Mauricio Sainz? A supervisor. Okay, a supervisor. Yeah. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, no problem. Okay. Other questions? Yes, but answer. Can you question? Um, who, who are in the conversation? Asalia. Hola. Me escucha. Who are in... in who the are speakers. in... Who are, who are the speakers? Who are the speakers in the conversation? Who are the speakers in the conversation? Uh, information. Uh, who? He employees, you say? No, who are... Who are... In the, the, speakers. In the speakers. Who are in the speaker in the conversation? Who? Ah, okay. Mr. Mr. Pedro Pedro Rigi. Okay, uh, okay, thank you very much uh, for asking the questions and practicing the conversation. Okay. So uh, let's listen to uh, two pairs, okay? Only two pairs. So let's listen to two to two. Let me see. To Mayra, okay. Mayra, who is your pair? My pair is Osmin. Osmin, all right. Can you perform the conversation, please? Yes. All right. Good morning. This is Mr. Pedro Rigit. Hi, Osmin. Excuse me, my mic. My mic. It's uh, okay. Good morning. Good morning, Mr. Rigit. This is Mac from Human Resource. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. What kind of information do you need? We are checking on some references. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warning and the feedback we have about him from his supervisor in that in that he is responsible i see do you consider he has what it is required at a managerial position excellent very good i like bye, your pronunciation bye. very good excellent mayra and osmin very good pronunciation very good all right, let's listen to another okay. pair. Let's, let's listen to Rafael. Who is your pair, Rafael? Uh, Miguel. All right. Okay, uh, you're first, Rafa. Okay. <clears throat> Good morning, this is Mr. Pedro Rigid. Good morning, Mr. Rigid. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I would like to have more information about Mauricio Sanchez. Okay. What kind of information do you need? We are checking on some reference. We are, we are planning to promote him as a manager. Mr. Sanchez does not have any warnings. And the feedback we have about him from the supervisor is that he is a responsible. I see. Do you consider he has what is required at a manager managerial position? Very good. That's awesome. Excellent pronunciation. So thank you, Miguel and Rafa. I really like your pronunciation. Very good. Okay. Let's listen to a last pair. Okay. Let's listen to Sulma. I haven't heard Sulma today. Okay. Who is your pair, Sulma? Ophelia. Oh, nice. We haven't heard Ophelia either. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, you start, Ophelia. Okay. Good morning. I guess Mr. Pedro. Yeah. Hola, hello. Hola, perdón, Can... perdón. It's okay, continue. Solo. Ya me trago al pedo. Ya. Good morning, Mr. Regit. This is Max from HR. How can I help you? Hi, Max. I could like to have money. Information. I was Mauricio Sanchez. Okay, what kind of information do you need? I wear chicken on Sony reference. I wear Barney's to promotion. He has manager. Sanchez doesn't have any warnings and the feedback we have about him from his supervisor is that he is responsible. I see, I do consider it. I he has what is recurrence I managing reposition. Okay, thank you very much. That's very good, Ophelia and uh, Sulma. Thank you very much. Okay, congratulations. Very good. Okay, uh, and thank you everyone because I know everybody uh, practice the conversation, right? So thank you very much. Now I want you. Um, I want everybody uh, to pay attention to something on the on the conversation. Okay. Look, pay attention to the following sentences, okay? Uh, on the conversation, pay attention to these sentences. <clears throat> Sorry. For example, we are checking on some references. Pay attention to this sentence. And I have a question about this sentence. We are checking on some references. The question is, is this action happening in the moment or is happening uh, like in these days? What do you think? Mm, it's happening these days. days. It's happening these days. Very good. Sentence number two. We are planning to promote him as a manager. Is it's a future. It's in future. Or is happening these days? Is something they are planning these days? This day. Exactly. It's something they are planning these days. And keep this in mind, please. All right. So listen. Uh, for, in this case, we are going to use uh, the present continuous for ongoing activities. What is ongoing? Any idea? Actividades en proceso. Actividades en proceso o en curso. This is ongoing activities, okay? And look, uh, when we want to write a sentence about an ongoing activity, okay, I want you to pay attention to this. I have a formula here, okay? And listen. Um, in this case, we are using the present continuous for ongoing activities or ongoing events. Okay, eventos en curso. Good. Now imagine here I have the, the formula for this. Okay, here I have the formula for this. So look, look, okay, hold on a second. So look, imagine I say here, um, the, the example here is um, we, are planning, right? We are planning um, to uh, promote him as for a managerial position. Very good. So I have the subject we, I miss or are, the verb that is with ing planning, okay, with ing, and the complement. Now, tell me something you are doing these days. Tell me something you personally are doing these days. For example, in my case, uh, I can say, I am, I am working, I am working um, at Inglés Corporativo. So this is an ongoing action. Es una acción en curso. It's an ongoing action, right? I am working at Inglés Corporativo. What about you? Tell me something you are doing these days. Díganme algo que están haciendo estos días. Tell me something you are doing these days. Yes? I am, I am studying. studying. I am celebrating. I am studying? English. 
Very good. So that's one example. I am studying English. It's an ongoing action, right? Es una acción en curso. It's an ongoing action. Uh, somebody said, I am celebrating. I am celebrating what? My birthday. I am celebrating my birthday. Independent. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that, I mean, the, the example is okay, but this action is not ongoing. Esta acción no es en curso. I am celebrating my birthday. Maybe it's an action in future or in the moment, okay, but not ongoing, pero no es ongoing, okay? Tell me another example, please. Ongoing I actions. Am I am? I, 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 okay, Osmin first. Osmin. Okay. I am working in my house very good i am working in my house is an ongoing action right maybe because of the pandemic That's for the pandemic, okay i am working from my house from my house in this case i am working from my house it's ongoing it's an ongoing course so it's ongoing okay rosa do you want to say something uh -huh. can i say i'm doing many things at work yes that's correct I'm doing many things at work. Imagine uh, you are reading a book. Imagine you are reading what? Let me see um, Tom Sawyer, for example. You say, I am reading Tom Sawyer. Es una acción en curso. I haven't finished. No la he terminado. I am reading Tom Sawyer. Okay, very good. So uh, if you want to use the negative on this space, no. you put not. For example, I'm not yeah. planning to promote Anybody, okay? Or I am not working at Inglés Corporativo. So this is negative, okay? So now I ask, do you have any question about this? Or is clear? Yes, teacher. It's very clear, I think, right? Now let's look at let, let's look at some examples. Let's look at some examples on the on the on the book. All right. Here are here we have some examples. On page number uh, 36. Check these examples. Uh, the examples here are the following. Okay, we have the first. Can you read it, please, Flor? Can you read example number one? We are updating. We are updating the information this weekend. This weekend, right? Like they are on this weekend. Ya están en ese fin de semana. So it's an ongoing action. Es una acción en progreso. We are updating the information this Weekend, okay? They are on the weekend already. Yeah, están en el fin de semana cuando dijeron eso. They are on the weekend, okay? Uh, number uh, two. Angela, can you read number two, please? The staff? Yes, teacher. The staff is planning to give him a promotion. Exactly. So it's an ongoing action, okay? Es una acción en curso. It's an ongoing action, okay? And we have, for the negative, we put not to the verb to be. For example, you can say, we are not updating the information this moment, or the staff is planning to give in, is not, sorry, is not planning to give in a promotion. So listen, you can use short form. También pueden decir, aren't, in this case, you can say, uh, isn't, okay, short form, or you can say, um, I'm not, okay? Podemos usar la forma corta también, I'm not. Uh, she isn't. And blah blah blah. Okay. Now, do you have any question? No, teacher. No, no questions. No question. It's clear. Just it's clear. remember, remember yes. this 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 tense, este tiempo, has different purposes. Okay. But the purpose of today is to use the present continuous for ongoing actions. Para acciones en curso. That's the purpose of today. All right. Yeah. It has different purposes, but the purpose of today is to use the present continuous for ongoing actions, okay? Ongoing actions. How do you write ongoing? How do you write ongoing? It's here, right? Okay, ongoing situations or ongoing actions, okay? Very good. Now, if you have no questions, then uh, let's work on the following uh, exercise. So listen, on the following exercise, this exercise is on page number uh, 36. Page number 36. On this page, you have some verbs. 
for example, you have the verb plan, call, check, write, send, and speak. All right. So please write one example for each verb. Can be about you or about a colleague. Okay, they can be about you or about a colleague. For example, you can say, we are planning a project in my company. We are planning a project in my company. Es una acción en curso, right? Or call, we are calling clients these days or this week, you can say. We are calling clients this week. Or my boss, my boss is checking um, the offices, okay? these days, all right? So please, write one example for each verb. Escribamos seis ejemplos, six examples, please. Any question? No? No. All right. Thank you, teacher. All right. This is on page number uh, 36, okay? Page number 36, activity five. You can put expressions at the end. You can put expressions like this week, these days, porque son acciones en, en progreso, okay, o en curso. So you can put this week, these days, all right? So you can put that. For this example, month. this month, exactly. This yeah. month, you can say this month. Thank you. So you can say, you can say, for example, I am writing a report this month, a big report, okay? Tomen la fórmula en cuenta, la fórmula que le di, por favor, okay? The formula I gave you, take it into account. Si no la tienen ahí, aquí está también la fórmula, por aquí arribita, okay? It's here. Por acá está, it's here. We is a subject, for sure. Yeah. Yes, we is a subject. Okay. Thank you. All the pronouns are subjects, okay? Remember, a, okay. Sub a subject is uh, de lo que se habla o de quien se habla en la oración. Okay, that's a subject. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. 
I'm going to give you uh, four more minutes, okay? Four minutes to finish. <laughs> Page number 36, okay? <laughs> Sandra, usted tiene What? la sesión hoy, ¿verdad? Yes. Ah, ok, perfect. You change with us, me. Yes. Ok, perfect. Yes, sir. Ok. Okay, well, while you finish, uh, let me pass the attendance, okay? While you finish, to take advantage of time. Ada? Present. Adriana? Present. Michelle? Present. Present. Angela? Present, teacher. Azalia? Present, teacher. Not Very good. Not yet. <laughs> Darwin? Present, teacher. Flor. Present. Gloria. Here. Carla. Present. Margarita. Mayra. Present. Miguel. Present teacher. Nelson. Present teacher. Present. Ofelia. Here teacher. Osmin. Here teacher. Rafa. Present. Rosa. Present. Sandra. Present teacher. Jansi. Present teacher. Zulma. Present. Ingrid. Lourdes. Oscar. Here teacher. Oh, Lourdes, yes, right? Here. Yes. Very good.
Um, okay, let me see. Hold on a second. Oscar. And Susana. Present teacher. Very good. Thank you. Okay, are you ready? Do you have your sentences? Not yet, Miguel? Yeah. Yes, just yes. not yet. Yes. yes. Okay, can you please yes. go to reactions and if you have your sentences, raise, raise your hand, okay? Los que ya terminaron, vayan a reactions y me levantan la mano, porfa. And you raise your hand, please. The majority. Okay, very good. Uh, well, I guess the majority finished. Okay, uh, very good. Now listen, um, I want to listen to your sentences, okay? I want to listen to your sentences. Uh, let's see, first uh, using, okay, let me go here to my phone. So I have the book here. Leave the hand like that. I see the hand a mano, leave the hand like that, please. Uh, excuse me, excuse me. Leave the hand excuse up, please. Okay, um, well, what is the first verb? What is the first verb? Please help me. I don't have planning. the menu on here. Plan. 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 Okay, the, the first verb is plan. All right, very good. So let's see. Um, let's see. Let's see. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, um, Gloria, can you share one example using plan, please? We are planning the meeting of the group. Repeat the example, please. We are planning the meeting of the week. Ah, we are planning the meeting of the week. Very good. That's excellent. Okay. Thank you very much, Gloria. Thank you very much. Okay, let's listen to um, Carla. The same, using plan. The same, okay. I am planning my next vacation. You're planning, oh my goodness, what a plan. <laughs> thank you, thank you very much, Carmen. All right, what is the next verb? Tell me please, what is the next verb? Call. Call. Okay, Adriana, one example using call. I am calling to the suppliers in this week. Oh, very good. Uh, I am calling the suppliers this week. Very good. That's excellent. Thank you very much, Adriano. Uh, Asalia, the same, using call. I am calling clients every day. I am calling clients every day. All right, that's excellent. Thank you very much. Yes. Now let's listen, let's listen to Susana using the verb check. Okay. Okay. They are checking all bugs. All right, very good. That's excellent. Thank you very much. Let's listen to Nelson. The same, using the verb check. He's checking your mail. Okay, very good. My mail or his mail? Mail. His, his mail. Okay, your, his, his mail. Ma, here's, no, his, his right? mail. His email. Okay, very good. His That's mail. excellent. Thank you very much, Nelson. Okay, now you seeing uh, the next verb. What is the next the next verb? Can you tell me, please? Right, right. right. Okay, right. Right. This. Using right. Lower this. The microphone. Lower this. Sorry, sorry. It's okay. Uh, you are writing a letter too fast. Okay, that's excellent. Thank you very much, Angela. The same. Using right. Um. We are writing in book. We are writing a book. Okay, that's very good. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Okay, now let's see. The next verb is send. Okay, it's send, poeta. send. Yeah, she's a poet. Okay, Rosa, you see in send. I'm sending the report to my boss. Okay, that's perfect. Very good. Uh, let's listen to Flor. You see in send. I I am sending a homework. I am sending homework. Okay, that's very good. <laughs> I like that example. 
Very good. Excellent. Very good, Flora. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much. That's very good. And the last verb is speak. All right. Let's listen speak. to speak. That's right. Jansi, using speak. Speak. Rafa and I are speaking about the work. About work. Okay. That's excellent. Very good. Thank you very much. Sandra, the same, using the verb speak. Sandra. My uncle is speaking to Canada. All right, very, he's speaking to? To Canada. Mm, maybe about, you can say about, about Canada. Acerca de Canada? About. Speaking, okay, about, okay, about. Please don't say about. that. Please don't say okay. that. <laughs> Please don't say that. You will make me cry. All right. Uh, so <laughs> I'm very sad. Okay. So everybody, uh, it's time. It's 10 3 already. Okay. So um, thank you very much for connecting. And just reminder, solo un recordatorio siempre. Mañana antes de la sesión, Tarea de la semana 3 o sección 3 completa. Ok, please, all right. No quiero estarles texteando ahí. Yo sé que algunos ya terminaron, ok. Pero para los que no han terminado, no quiero estarles avisando a última hora. Por favor, mande la tarea, ok. So, um, so everybody, okay. thank you very much for connecting. Good night, goodbye, sweet dreams. Good night. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Bye, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye, everybody. Bye, bye. 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 Hi, teacher. <laughs> Hello. All right, let's see. Uh, Hello, Sandra. teacher. Hello. Yes. Yes? Hi, teacher. Hello. Yes. I'm listening to you. So this space is for you. So tell me. Um, for example, uh, the homework, uh, I understand. Uh, Como how request o como answer, como how answer, eh, was I later. Eh, yo pensaba que tenía que ser yes I did, no, no reconocía cómo responder, cuál verbo usar. Ok. ¿En qué homework? ¿En cuál yes. tarea? ¿En qué homework? ¿O en general? Eh, no, no, en la 13. 13 ok, en la 13. Que... Ok, if you want, we can check. Si gusta, podemos revisarla. Ok. ¿Te parece? Uh, yes. Ok, veamos. Let's see. Let me look for it. Voy ahorita. I am going there. Let me go, let me go and look for it. Ok. It's number 13, right? Es la número 13. Creo que sí, era la 13, sí. Ok, what's we'll that? Yeah, what's I later? Ajá, es la eh, del pasado. Is the one about yes, the past. Yes, eh, yo estaba respondiendo yes I do y pues nada que ver. Ya. Ok, <laughs> es en la sección 3, ¿verdad? Ajá, sí. Ok, voy ahorita, ahorita la estoy buscando. I'm looking for it. I'm looking for it. La número 13 me dice, ¿verdad? Sí. Veamos. La de Was I Late? Were you in school yesterday? Esa. Yes. ¿Ya? Yeah? Esa, yes. Sandra. Ok, vaya, voy a, voy a ponerla por acá. I will display it here. Es esta, ¿verdad? Is this one, right? Es. Uh -huh. Was ah. I late? Um... Ah, en las respuestas. In the answers, you mean in the answers. Ajá, así es. Yo estaba respondiendo, yes, I do. Uh -huh. o, o, o me confundo porque dice, o, este, porque no relacionaba eh, cuál era el, el eh, ¿cómo se llama? ¿Con cuál verbo responder? Si era con okay. el mismo. Entiendo. Sí, este... Siempre vamos a responder con el verbo auxiliar que nos están preguntando. ¿Ok? 
<coughs> perdón. Y en este caso, el verbo auxiliar que se está usando esas preguntas puede ser was o es where. ¿Ok? Obviamente, si me hacen la pregunta was I late, ¿cuál sería la respuesta? Eh, sería entonces yes. Yes, ajá, uh, you. You were. You were. Ah, uh, yes, you were. Ahí le pongo el punto siempre. Yes, you were. ¿Ok? Y así, depende de lo que me pregunte, así voy a contestar. It depends, ¿ok? Y voy para la respuesta, voy a usar ya sea el was o el where. ¿Ok? Were, were you in school yesterday? ¿Qué va a responder ahí? Eh... Yes. Uh, yes. Yes, I, I, I where? Yes, I. No, pero con el I no se usa el where. ¿Para yes, cuáles pronombres? Ajá, vaya. Yes, I was. Exactamente, vaya. Lo primero que tenemos que ver es para cuáles pronombres se usa el was y para cuáles pronombres se usa el where. ¿Ok? Vaya, el uh -huh. was, el was se usa para los pronombres I, he, she, it. Was. I, he, she, it. El was, ¿ok? Was. Y el where se usa para los demás pronombres, para los plurales. We, you, they. We, you, they. Y para el you en okay. singular. Ajá. Para los pronombres we, you, they. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Ajá. Así que voy a responder. Si, si respondo con el I, tendría que usar el yes, I, was. Porque el was lo uso con el I, ¿ok? O si voy a responder, yes, he. Ajá, yes, he was. Was. Yes, he was. O si voy a responder con el we, por ejemplo, yes, we. Where. Where, ajá, porque con los pronombres we, you, they se usa el where. Ese es para positivo. Y ahí dice que tienen que contestar de forma positiva o de forma negativa, ¿verdad? Sí. Si la respuesta es negativa, voy a contestar usando... Para el negativo de was, uso wasn't. Y para el negativo de where, uso weren't. Wearing, okay. Weren't, weren't, ok. Por ejemplo, um, una respuesta negativa sería no, I, no, I wasn't, por ejemplo. Ok, no, I wasn't. Y en plural podría ser no, We weren't, for example. Weren't, weren't. Uh, weren't, no we weren't, for example, ok? Y el punto, en the period. Ah, ok. Ajá, de, queda, ajá, quedarían de esa manera. Ahora bien, si me están preguntando con el did, si sí contesto con el did. Si me están preguntando con el do, contesto con el do. O con el das, contesto con el das, ok? Depende con qué verbo auxiliar me estén haciendo la pregunta. Sí, porque cuando, eh, no sé si fue en la sección 2 que decía use el simple. Presente simple. El presente simple, igual, este, solo era de guardas, ¿verdad? Me parece. Exactamente, exacto, Ajá. exactamente. Ajá. Sí, a eso e me igual... refiero. Ajá, e igual no, 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 no identificaba por qué agregar das y no ar o is. Ah, es que eh. depende del tiempo verbal en el que estamos hablando. También, ¿ok? Si estamos hablando en el presente simple, vamos a usar el do, el das, el am, el is o el are, en este caso. Y vamos a contestar en, en base al auxiliar que se está usando en la pregunta. ¿Ok? Ok. Ajá, y si... Ajá. Este es, como, es como, digamos, una regla que Exacto. siempre vamos a contestar en base al... Al auxiliar de la pregunta. Si al se auxiliar. Usa, si se usa did en la pregunta, contestamos con did, que es para pasado también. Ajá, si se okay. usa do, respondemos con do. Por ejemplo, do you play or, or do you check email every day? Estoy usando el do. Así que yo digo yes, I do, do. en la respuesta. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. O en pasado, por ejemplo, uh, ¿fuiste a trabajar ayer? Did you go to work yesterday? Como uso el did como auxiliar, en la respuesta llego, digo, perdón, yes, I Did. ¿Ok? okay. Uh -huh. ¿Ya? ¿Sí? ¿Se entiende, sí. Sandra? Sí. 
-huh. Ok, perfecto. Siempre voy a usar el auxiliar. En la respuesta, in the answer. En la respuesta. Ah, Exactamente. Okay. Si es una respuesta cerrada, ¿verdad? Por supuesto. Ah, claro. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ya sea... Sí, corta, ¿verdad? Sí. Y Correctamente. Corta, ¿verdad? Ajá, una yes, no question. Short. Exactamente. Ajá, una, ah, ajá, voy a dar una okay. short answer. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh -huh. Sí. Trate de hacer el ejercicio. Si hay dudas, si le sale malo, me manda un mensajito ahí para verificar si hay algún error, tal vez. Ok. 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 Uh -huh. Thank you, teacher. Ok. Thank you for uh, connecting. A usted, teacher. Ok. Good night. Good night, teacher. Ok. See you, See you tomorrow. Thank you.